Future of Intelligent Machines, welcome to our deep dive into the latest breakthroughs in AI-powered humanoid robots. Just days after DeepSeek AI made waves in the tech world, a new spectacle took center stage. 16 humanoid robots performing a synchronized dance at China's Spring Festival Gala. These robots, created by Unitary Robotics, moved in perfect sync with human dancers, astonishing audiences, and igniting discussions across X, formerly Twitter, and Reddit. But this wasn't just any routine. These robots flawlessly executed the Yanko dance a traditional folk performance from Northeast China, tossing handkerchiefs, spinning, and maintaining balance effortlessly. Most humanoid robots struggle with basic stability, but these H1 units didn't just stand their ground, they danced. Inevitably, comparisons to Tesla's Optimus robot flooded social media. While Optimus has faced challenges in basic walking and grasping objects, Unitary's robots performed intricate movements with ease. The H1 model, standing 1.8 meters, 5 foot 11 tall, and weighing 47 kilo 104 pounds, spent three months training with AI to master the routine. By using laser slam positioning, these robots adapted to stage conditions, like uneven flooring and fast formation changes. First unveiled in August 2023, they even made an appearance at NVIDIA's GTC conference in 2024. Each unit retails for approximately 650 thousands, about 90,000 USD, proving that advanced robotics are becoming more commercially viable. Beyond entertainment, China is rapidly advancing AI and robotics technology. Following the debut of DeepSeek AI, global governments, including India, have raised data security concerns, and even Elon Musk voiced skepticism about the AI model. Meanwhile, the competition in humanoid robotics is heating up worldwide. Figure AI, known for its Figure 02 humanoid, has been making headlines. Originally backed by OpenAI, Figure AI just walked away from its partnership to develop in-house AI instead. CEO Brett Adcock emphasized that real-time embodied AI cannot be outsourced, leading the company to build end-to-end -end AI for humanoid control. And OpenAI? They aren't backing down. They're now investing in Norway-based 1X, another humanoid robotic startup, while also filing a trademark for AI-driven humanoid assistance that could communicate and entertain users. While some companies focus on home-use robots, Figure AI is targeting industrial applications. BMW has already started testing Figure AI robots in a South Carolina factory, a move that could revolutionize automation in manufacturing. Adcock has even teased a groundbreaking reveal in the coming 30 days, a first-of-its-kind advancement in humanoid robots. Now, let's talk about robotic hands. Elon Musk recently described Tesla's Optimus hand as being more intricate than a Fabergé egg, highlighting its complexity. Clone Robotics responded, claiming their own muscle-based humanoid hand is lighter, stronger, and cheaper to produce compared to Tesla's motor-based design. They even joked that their soft actuators could give massages and hugs. This friendly rivalry is shaping the future of AI-powered dexterity. Whether muscle-based actuators or motorized components will define next-gen robots remains a key debate. Meanwhile, NVIDIA and Carnegie Mellon University have taken humanoid motion to the next level with ASAP, aligning simulation and real-world physics for learning agile humanoid skills. This new training framework allows robots to mimic professional athletes, analyzing movements from Cristiano Ronaldo's footwork, LeBron James' silencer celebration, and Kobe Bryant's legendary fadeaway shot. Using motion capture and reinforcement learning, these robots first train in simulations before transitioning to real-world physics. The challenge? Robots often struggle when moving from simulation to reality, where factors like motor heat, mechanical stress, and unexpected physics variations cause breakdowns. By implementing real-world feedback loops, NVIDIA's research helps bridge this gap, enabling humanoid robots to refine their movements for smoother, more lifelike agility. However, perfecting humanoid motion isn't cheap. Unitary Robotics H1 model costs around $90,000 per unit, while Figure AI has raised $1.5 billion in funding to accelerate development. Tesla, OpenAI, NVIDIA, and Clone Robotics are all racing to perfect humanoid AI 
with each taking a unique approach. Some companies prioritize factory automation, where robots are trained for precise, repetitive industrial tasks. Others aim for home-use robots, which require more flexible problem-solving skills to adapt to dynamic, unpredictable environments, like avoiding pets, responding to human cues, and handling household objects safely. In summary, China is making massive strides in AI and robotics. Unitary's dancing humanoids wowed audiences worldwide, and with shorter AI training times, these robots are improving rapidly. Meanwhile, figure AI's split from OpenAI signals a major shift in humanoid AI development, and the competition in robotic hands is intensifying between Tesla's motor-based and clone robotics muscle-based approaches. Finally, NVIDIA and Carnegie Mellon's ASAP framework could usher in a new generation of athletic, agile humanoid robots, making them far more lifelike and adaptable than ever before. With big reveals coming soon, the race for humanoid AI supremacy is just getting started. Will Figure AI's secret project be a game changer? How will Tesla's next Optimus update stack up? And what groundbreaking innovation will NVIDIA and CMU unveil next? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. If you enjoyed this update on AI and robotics, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.